Hello and welcome. In this lesson, let's try to layer a simple Azure function that runs based on a Cosmos DB trigger. This Azure function is trying to detect high-speed vehicles on the highway. Let's assume when a vehicle is passing in a specific location, vehicle details are captured and saved in a document database. I have created an empty Azure function app and added the Cosmos DB trigger template. You can see the code template here. Let's move to the Azure portal. I have already created the Cosmos DB account for this demo. So we are in the Data Explorer tab. So you can see this database called To Do List is created under that items collection is created. In order to connect to this database, you have to provide the connection string information. You can go to the key section here and grab the primary connection string from here. Okay, so let's move back to the code. So in here, you can see the database name, collection name is provided and the connection string information can be retrieved from the settings file. Also, in your code, you should ask about the, this leases collection. This leases collection is used to store state information of the changes in the items container. So you should ask to create the leases collection when you run your trigger. Okay, so the real coding begins now. Let's assume a document is created when a vehicle is passed in a specific point in the highway. Try to grab this data. We want to analyze the speed of the vehicle. At first, we have to get the vehicle number by reading the created document. So I will be trying to create a variable to hold the vehicle number. So we are getting list of documents. So I want to get the first document and call the get property value function in it. So I assume the vehicle number is a type of string. So you have to pass the vehicle number, this property, and I will copy the same value three more times. At next, we have to retrieve the speed of the vehicle. Then we have to pass the, the city or maybe the vehicle passed location and also the mobile number of the driver. One more thing, for the speed, I assume that the data type of the speed value is double. Okay, so after collecting all these information about the speed of the vehicle, we can analyze it and provide a warning message to the user. So I'm going to create a if condition to check the speed value. If this is over 80, so I'm going to construct a warning message. So we have to construct the warning message as high speed detected in this city. This is the vehicle number. And also this is the speed of the vehicle. And also I want to print this as a warning message. Okay, so we are done with the coding. Let's run this application. So you can see the function console like this. Let's move to the Azure portal and try to create a document from the Data Explorer. So then we will be able to test this function app. So I will be going into items and click on the new item. And I will be pasting this JSON document and hit on save. And we'll move back to the function console. So you can see this warning message is displayed like this. Okay, so in this video, we have created the Cosmos DB trigger function app and tested it with some real data in the database. Until the next video, goodbye.